Wrestling fans back with you on NWA Classics 24-7. This is a spectacular match from 1979 as the high-flying Vicky Williams takes on the Polynesian princess Lilani Kai in a ladies wrestling matchup. I will tell you, ladies and gentlemen, these are not battling bombshells. They're not divas. These are highly trained professional athletes. The kind of female wrestling that you're only going to see right here in the National Wrestling Alliance. And there you see Williams with a beautiful snapmare to Leilani Kai. Also to keep in mind that this is a two out of three falls matchup where the key purpose is to beat your opponent not once, but twice. Well, of course, you can win a match by pinfall, submission, or disqualification. Count out. Many, many different ways to win the match. But also, you got to keep in mind that there's a lot of other factors that you have to key in when it comes to winning a two out of three falls match. And one of them being, most importantly, stamina. Because when you're wrestling a two out of three falls match, you're going to be there for quite a while. Ilani Kainau with a wrist lock on Vicky Williams. Applying pressure to that wrist and elbow. You can see that arm twisted at an unhealthy angle. Vicky Williams now reversing that wrist lock. Now it appears that Leilani has the size advantage over Williams. But yeah, Williams has the experience edge over Leilani. Now both of them finding their bearings here. Trying to catch their second win here. Another lockup. Kai getting to the ropes. Causing the referee to make the break here. Both of these wrestlers quite unorthodox. Neither of them wearing wrestling uh, footwear. Not only that, but they're not wearing knee pads or elbow pads. Or wrist tape, for that matter. Nice chain wrestling by Vicky Williams. Oh, that, that was a beautiful takedown by Williams. And once again, Williams targeting that left arm of Leilani Kai. Just wrenching on that arm here. Looks very difficult to get out of. Referee now checking to see if Leilani Kai would like to submit. It's a very painful hold. And Leilani Kai now going to the ropes to force a break. Now this is very, very important because this is the first fall of this two out of three falls match. And a win here could spell the inevitable victory. Oh, beautiful push over there. And another beautiful arm drag once again to that left arm. Now, like I said, a pinfall win is very, very important because when you get that first win, that means you're at a one fall advantage, which means that the loser of the fall has to win two straight times to win the matchup. There you see Williams not letting up on that arm hold. And once again, showing off that beautiful chain wrestling. Kai doing a little complaining there to referee Nick Kozak. Lonnie Kai now with a hair pull now appears to be choking Vicky Williams. Kai's got to watch, watch out for that count. She doesn't want to get disqualified. Now getting physical with the referee. And Kozak once again getting physical with Kai. by Leilani Kai. Ooh, steps on the throat of Vicky Williams. Now Williams has got to be out of breath at that point. He can crush that larynx. Vicky Williams now draped over that second rope. Once again, targeting that throat area of Williams. And when you can't breathe, it's very hard to concentrate. 
Lonnie Kai now again, very effectively using those ropes. And there you see Kai very proud of herself and what she's doing. And now Kai showing off some chain wrestling of her own, which only gets a two count. Iris up to the ropes. Beautiful back elbow. Once again, another cover and another two count. And now Kai having some choice words with referee Nick Kozak. Very surprised that the referee is giving some leeway. Five in this minutes, five minutes. Alani Kai now tearing at the eyes, looking at the face of Vicky Williams. Vicky Williams now trying to clear the cobwebs. Not having very many opportunities to clear those cobwebs, especially with Kai right on the attack. Lilani Kai relentless in her attack on Vicky Williams now. Here we, go. we got a scoop and a slam there by Kai. Could this be it and no another two counts? Vicky now Williams now still trying to shake those cobwebs free. And just as she tries to shake those cobwebs off, some more cobwebs are being, are being on there, being displayed by Leilani Kai. Hard elbow by Leilani Kai. One, two. Kick out by Vicky Williams at the count of two. Leilani Kai now really dishing out the punishment on Vicky Williams. Some knee shots being displayed there. Very unorthodox one is Leonie Kai. And once again, Williams kicks out. The snap there, there. Let's see if this will. Let's see if this will be it. And no, it's not. Both of these wrestlers nearing the point of exhaustion, fans. And we're only in the first fall. I would say Williams would be the more exhausted one in this one. But whatever the case is, Williams is fighting back. But once again, Ty relentlessly dishing out that punishment. Very, very aggressive opponent. One, two. This time she tried to put her weight on Williams, but to no avail. Williams powering out. And again, the Lonnie Kai choking Vicky Williams on that top ring rope. Whoa. Williams just bounced off those ropes. And not even a two count at that time. Looks like frustration is settling in. Guy's gotta watch out for that temper. Oh, and a kick reversal. And a jumping elbow drop. A little final scream, I guess. Victory yell. Whatever it was, it got out of the win. Lonnie Kai wins the first fall with by pinfall. Seven minutes, 58 seconds. The first ball Five minutes the and 58 champion, seconds. Lonnie Kai. Lonnie Kai. Very he pleased with himself. Vicky Williams now, of course, has an uphill battle to try to. She now has to win two straight falls if she's going to win this match. Well, lucky for Williams, she's going to get a two-minute rest period, and we see a replay of the action with that jumping elbow smash. Amazing camera work from 1979. Hard to believe that this was from 1979. And there you see that second elbow smash for good measure. And that was the elbow drop that got her. One. That got Kai. The one, the two, and the three. That's right. Milani Kai, clearly the winner of the first fall. Two minute rest period in between falls. Let's take a look at the girls. See what they're up to. One minute, one minute to one go. One minute left. Vicki Williams now in the corner, trying to catch her breath. And as you pointed, Bruce, no divas, no bombshells in this one. This is the kind of female wrestling that you're only going to see right here in the National Wrestling Alliance. Both 
wrestlers now trying seconds. to catch their breath. Moving towards the second fall, wrestling fans. Some words with some ring, some ringsiders. Five, four, three, two, one. The bell. There's the bell, and the second fall is underway. Yolani Kai now immediately going after Vicky Williams, trying to continue that aggressive assault that was so effective for her in the first fall. Well, it did get her to the win in that first fall. Yolani Kai very and now, effective. Now the referee Nikosa oh my goodness. Is Referee caught a forearm smash. Clearly inadvertent. Well, whatever it was, referee Nick Kozak was not pleased. And there you see a knee lift there by Williams. Oh, and a drop kick. High, high drop kick by Vicky Williams. One of the early high flyers of the women's wrestling world. High drop kick on Leilani Kai. But there you see Kai once again showing off that aggressiveness and once again taking control of this second fall. Alani Kai now again blatantly choking Vicky Williams. And there you see referee asking him, asking Kai if she wants to get a disqualification. It's a beautiful thing with these vintage classic wrestling tapes as you can the microphones are strategically placed around the ring you can actually hear the wrestlers talking you can hear the, the bodies as they smack into one e one another you can hear the screams as they're stepping on each other's throat Vicky Williams now again thrown to the ring floor by Lalani Kai and there is no padding on that floor, ladies and gentlemen. That's hard concrete. And Kai not letting Williams back into the ring. And now jaw jacking with the referee. This is not sports entertainment wrestling fans. This is National Wrestling Alliance professional wrestling at its best. Lonnie Kai now impatiently waiting for Vicky Williams to get back in the ring. And once again, Kai not letting Williams back into the ring. Referee now warning Lonnie Kai. I don't know how much more jaw jacking referee Nick Kozak can take from Lonnie Kai. Williams better watch out for that count. Williams now moving very slowly. Looks as if she injured her hip or back area on that fall outside the ring. And now Williams goes for the throat. Looks like this is Williams' match for the taking. Beautiful side headlock followed by an Irish whip. Oh, jumping elbow. And we got the second fall. Williams scored the pinball with that reverse elbow. The fall, the defeating uh, Alani Kai for the second fall. It's one fall apiece now, Jeremy. It'll be a two minute rest period. And now we are all tied up. And this is anybody's match at this point. Alani Kai now very upset with the referee. Complaining about Vicky Williams pulling her tights. I didn't see any of those tactics. Well, from my vantage point, I didn't see any of those tactics. This has been a grueling, grueling contest. Ladies and gentlemen, let's go back to some slow motion action. Vicky Williams into the ropes from outside headlock. Over the top. And there you see that jumping elbow. Beautiful reverse elbow by Vicky Williams. Here we go, there you see referee Nick Kozak with the one, with the two, and finally with the three count that got Williams. One minute, one minute to go. 
One fall apiece, fans. Lilani Kai, the winner of the first fall. Vicki Williams evening it up with a victory in the second fall. This match is for all the marbles, ladies and gentlemen. The winners share the prize, obviously much more than the losers share. And this is why you gotta love professional wrestling fans, because in professional wrestling, in any seconds. given moment, the tide can turn within the drop of a hat. Here you see both competitors getting ready for this third and final fall. Both wrestlers anxious to make contact before the bell rings. Not surprised they didn't make contact at all. Five, four, three, two, one, the bell. Here we go, this third and final fall is underway, ladies and gentlemen. Who's gonna get the final decision? There you see some beautiful hair peels being displayed by Williams. And Williams just sends Kai to the outside. Vicky Williams not happy with the tactics of the Lonnie Kai pulling that hair. And now it's Williams being in control of this fall. In the second fall, it was Kai starting things off with the aggressiveness, but now Williams is returning the favor. Williams now bringing the Lonnie Kai into the ring over that top row. The hard way, if you will. And now just catapulting Kai. Here we go. Could this be it already? And no, Kai just kicks out right at two. Maisie Kai trying to get back into things. A little back and forth here with those forearm shots. And Lonnie Kai now. Taking those shortcuts again, going to the eyes of Vicky Williams. Referee trying to admonish Kai with, the, with that eye rake. But Williams is coming back. Lilani Kai missing with the looping right hand. One, two. No. A little monkey flip, but Williams right back on her feet. And a beautiful high drop kick. Ooh, another shot to the gut there. But Kai is firing back with those forearms. Go Williams to the turnbuckle. What's Kai setting up here? Kai trying to tell the referee to get out of the way. Ricky Williams slowly getting to her feet. Lonnie Kai now. Shoulder smashes to the midsection. <laughs> and now Kai just pulling Ripper Nook pulls that shirt over his head. Oh, beautiful sunset flip there. Hey, could this be it? We got a winner. Sunset flip by Vicky Williams. And two minutes, 17 seconds. And and the the new Texas Girls champion for the Lonnie Crown. In this exciting two out of three falls bout, Vicky Williams now being awarded the new the Texas Girls champion. She Vicky is the Williams. Texas Ladies Champion for the National Wrestling Alliance back in 1979. What a spectacular victory for Vicki Williams. Look at the fan at ringside with a Polaroid camera.